assalamu alaikum friends you are watching star technology 5g in today's video i will show you how you can select the switch case let's start the video project description in this project leds are connected to port c and the two switches are connected to rd6 and rd7 pin of the pic 16f887 microcontroller and the microcontroller is operated from a 4 MHz crystal LEDs are connected in current syncing mode and the value of the resistor are 260 ohm when switch 1 is pressed it selects the switch case and when we press switch 2 it will display the result circuit diagram here is the pic 16 f 7 pin number 14 and 13 interface with the crystal we are using 4 MHz crystal and we are using 22 pf crystal here is the reset circuit the value of the resistor is 10k when we will pass the switch microcontroller get restored here is the port c port c are interface with 8 leds we are using current syncing mode and we are using the value of the resistor is 260 ohm and here is the rd6 and rd7 pin we are using two switch one is interface with rd6 pin and other is interface with rd7 pin and the value of the resistor we are using is 4.7 kilo ohm now we will draw this circuit in a proteus and after that we will test this circuit circuit is ready now we will write its code in mp lab and after that we will test this circuit Friends, main file is ready. I already wrote a code, otherwise, video get very long. I will copy this code and I will paste it. Here I will define you to code. Here is the XC header file. Here is the PIC16 or double seven header file. Here we define the crystal frequency. We are using 4 MHz crystal. And here we define the LEDs. LEDs are interface with the port C. You can see RC0, RC1, RC2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And here is the LED number 01234567. 
our LED is our interface with port number C and here we define a switch 1 and switch 2 switch 1 and switch 2 interface with the RD6 and RD7 pin and here is the function of the delay we are using delay as a debouncing delay from a main code is start in main code we select ERIS D6 and D7 as a input we set its value 1 and we set ERIS C is equal to a 0x00 we set port C as a output and here we send and in this line we create the all LEDs and here we define a one variable and we assign zero to the variable here is the while one loop while one loop is endless loop if we press the switch number one it will take delay and it will stay here it will increment the value of x if x value is increment and it's raised to nine it will set the value of x is equal to a zero and when we will press the switch number two it will take the delay for debouncing delay and it will stay here until we will not release the switch and here is the switch case select here is the value of the x we will give x to the switch and it will set the case initially its value is 0 and when we will press the switch number 1 it will increment the value of the x to the 1 it's been when we will press the switch number 2 it will select the switch case 1 because we will press this switch one time and it will toggle the LED number 0 and it will clear the value of the X and it will break the switch case when we will press this switch number 1 three times now it will increment the value of the X three times now the value of the x is equal to a 3 and when we will press the switch number 2 it will select the switch case 3 it will toggle the LED number 2 and it will clear the value of the x and it will break the switch case and when we will press the 4 times switch it will select the case number 4 it will toggle the LED number 3, it will clear the value of the X and it will break the switch case. Same like in case number 5, when we will press the switch number 1 5 times, it will select the case number 5, it will toggle the LED number 4 and it will clear the value of the X and it will break the switch case. Here is the case number 6, case number 6 is also same like the others it will toggle the LED number 5 it will create the value of the X and it will break the switch case here is the case number 7 and case number 8 are also same like others and at the end we have function of the delay we are using delay as a debouncing delay in debouncing delay we have one variable Y and we use that Y in a for loop to create some delay now we will create its X file. We will click on this build main project. A file is created. Now we will load this file into our circuit. Double click on the microcontroller and select the X file desktop pick 16f switch how to how to select switch case ok and run simulation here is the switch number one when we will press this switch three times one two and three this LED get turned on here is this display button you can see LED number 3 is on if we want to turn on the LED number 8 we need to press 8 time 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 
and 8 when we will press this switch it will display the LED number 8 if you want to turn on this LED this number is 5 we need to press this button 5 times you can see I press 4 times ok if you want to turn off the LED number 3 you need to press 3 times 1 2 3 and when we will press this switch switch number 2 it will invert the LED you can see we just use toggle sign just like LED turn on and off and if you want to anything else you can add any code here and it will perform that specific operation number one it will turn on the LED number one okay friend if you get any problem in code let me know in comments and keep watching starting technology 5G